Good morning. This is Bobby Dupre with the Bobby Dupre Show, presented to you each Thursday morning at 7 a.m. And, of course, it replays in its entirety on Sunday afternoon at 3 p.m. And we're on uh, various uh, cable uh, companies throughout Acadiana. Mm -hmm. And uh, now we're uh, also on the Internet and have been now for probably six, eight years. We're uh, old-timers on the Internet. Old-timers on the Internet. <laughs> and uh, more and more of you, of course, uh, are watching it uh, due to various various reasons, uh, having most of them to do is you have a, a di connection with uh, DirecTV and uh, we haven't been able to get on to DirecTV yet. yet. And I always put the yet because we're certainly trying and uh, we're going to be starting our, we would have been starting our 37th year on radio and i got to remember that. I can't keep saying that because uh, KSLO went Spanish and uh, they've uh, chosen not to let us have our program. And I'm going to talk to Chuck, uh, just talk to uh, Matt LeBlanc, who heads up our uh, technical television. Uh, television section. And he's, of course, he has really, you know, no decision making. But he will be seeing Chuck, I think, on Thursday afternoon. So uh, maybe we could talk and just do that program, if that's possible. Because uh, we have a lot of people that are asking, what happened? Mm -hmm. <laughs> well. Uh, uh, times are changing. And of course, we're talking about 36 years on radio, and of course I can talk about uh, a young man that uh, I got to know over the past 25 years who came to work with uh, the companies, we'll say, because you've worked with different companies, but uh, all of them at, uh, one point. Uh, at one point or another. And I'm speaking, of course, of my uh, sidekick here, mm -hmm. uh, who's been uh, our sidekick at uh, Dupre Carrier Gotcha, Imperial, Opelousas Underwriters, OPAC, OPAC and, uh, and, and, and others in between that that uh, we were invested in. And uh, 25 years, and I can still remember uh, we met in a car. You were kind of afraid. You were working for a company that... Uh, we were trying to keep it quiet. Keep it quiet, yeah. Until we could decide if we were really going to start dating. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, we went, there was uh, you and I and J.E. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And uh, we took a ride around Opelousas, uh, kind of, what do you use the word, clandestine? <laughs> Clandestine. Clandestine. That's it. Uh, undercover. Undercover. And uh, the company you were working with, uh, they, they had... They, they had, had been a friendly competitor, but then in the end, they had got to be sort of a, a not friendly competitor. I guess that's yeah, the way to put it. Yeah, and, and particularly the son. Uh, the, the daddy and I always got along right. all right, but uh, the son, for some reason, uh, and... I guess I know the reason because he said I didn't spend enough time with him when I went to visit their office. Right. Well, uh, I always dealt with the daddy, and with, if I saw him, I was, you know, cordial to him, but didn't know that I had to bow down to him. And he let me know that one night uh, at a hotel uh, <laughs> facility, and of course the people that were there. Uh, when they got indicted, uh, they called me the next day. They said, "You know, you did the right thing that night, uh, going up to the room, and Stay we all clear. and and everybody gradually just came up and met me in the room and uh, congratulated me. Not he, he had even brought his attorney and everything. He was wanting to create a situation, oh, right. and uh, and of course I can see why you left. Uh, things really got bad after that. Mm -hmm. uh, really I got. I bad. left at the peak. Thank you, goodness. You, yep. <laughs> you, 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 you're right. And it's been a good 20, 25 years, by the way. Quarter, 25 quarter years. Quarter of a century. Quarter of a century. Uh, you grew up, and uh, I grew up, <laughs> and uh, you started a new family, uh -huh. and uh, of course, uh, computers change. Uh -huh. And uh, there's been a lot of changes. And you have been our computer person that we go to. And uh, lots of really changes. I remember uh, the first big computer system we had, uh, we were leasing space uh, over in Baton Rouge. Mm -hmm. And I mean, this whole wall right here, I don't know if it would hold the computers that we had bought. We had bought that for about $40,000, I think. They were trying to unload it, it on it somebody. They just wanted to get it, get get, it gone. Get it going. Get it out of their yeah, hand. that's right. And uh, I guess the next best thing happened, it, 
the building caught fire, not in our department, but upstairs. Right, and of course, else. the water damaged the, our computers. And then uh, we rebuilt everything. We rebuilt, and we we had a, a, a work, good working agreement with another company. And y'all had to go to was it Covington? First National of Covington in those uh, days. Back in those days, had the same uh, computer. Uh, system, hardware yeah. system, and we had a working agreement with them, and uh, went over there. Uh, in fact, uh, that one of our employees uh, met a young man over there, and they and, got and married. They got married. Mm -hmm. And they got married. And they live right near Port Barrett. And have babies and everything. <laughs> and now. everything yeah. now. Grown so, babies. Yep. And so, uh, lots of things uh, we could we could talk all day, mm -hmm. and uh, I, I guess it hopefully it's interesting to them to know how we can. Uh, play off of each other on the program, but it's... We, you know, I've seen a lot of changes in the personal lives. We've seen a lot of changes in business lives. We've seen a lot of change in everything in yep, 25 yep, years yep, working 25 together. 25 years ago, uh, who was I married to? <laughs> who was I married to? Uh, 19, <laughs> what, what, what year was that? That would have been, uh, is that 88? 88, yeah, well, uh, 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 January uh, of 88, you, you yeah, would have been uh, with probably number single. two. Yeah, well, no, I'd have been, I'd have been, huh? oh no, I, I was... I think it was still, it was right at the think? end. You think, I think it, it was, was right at the end, Christy, of number two. Number two. <laughs> Anyhow, I was I was in number one. Uh, yeah, that <laughs> uh, that's right. You were uh, uh -huh. right, uh, and uh, it, it's been a. I've always, uh, especially back in those days, we worked long hours. I mean, it was long yes, hours. And uh, every day, every day. But on Wednesdays and Fridays, it was not uh, unusual for a good portion of the staff to meet up somewhere else and just kind of let our head down and really talk and visit and blow off know, the steam blow off the steam and it worked well for us mm -hmm. and uh, today you don't see as much of that with any of the companies i mean you know it, for whatever reason and uh but it worked well for us in those days it's it today it it the employ the workers have to go home more. Uh, the children are a lot more demanding today. A lot more active. The, the, active. You know, when you, when they, I was growing get, up, you had one sport. They timed it just right after school. The parents pitch up at the end of the thing. Now, you bring the kids back oh, and forth to oh, events yes. all afternoon and into the night. And and the husband and the wife. Okay, it takes both. It, if you got two it, kids, it, it, each got to go a separate way. Separate all way. And grandpa Most of the and grandma got to that, go. That's correct. <laughs> that's correct. So, anyhow, good 25 years. Thank yeah. you, Andrew. Well, Thank you. Uh, it's, uh, I guess, uh, our silver anniversary. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, and we want to thank uh, all of, I guess, my partners over the years. Mm -hmm. Oh, everybody. And, Jay uh, was very kind to me over the years. Joe Fred, Totsy Carrier, all, all the partners, very, very kind to me. And of course, yeah, all and, the employees that I've dealt with, for and, Jenny Crater, and, Kevin Carrier. And then now with uh, David Link and, David and Link. Lisa right. uh, in the Lisa, office, y'all sure. work very close together sure. uh, on a daily basis now. Sure. And uh, then we had uh, Barry Mitchell over in Southern General. Uh, I did a lot Southern of work General. there. You, we, we, we worked together there. Uh, when Blue and the whole crew with ABC came on, I'd spend yeah, a lot of time we, in that little I red was, truck all right. over the place. I was, I was involved uh, when when uh, ABC agency was bought from uh, Mr. Boudreau uh, mm -hmm. over in Metairie. Century 21, when that came online, I was involved with getting all that together, the computers there. So right. And, been and, a lot of uh, different... <laughs> Yeah, I'm, I'm sure I'm missing some. But anyhow, just to give you an idea, it, it's been a good fun run, and I hope there's many, many more. And uh, talking I'm, about I'm, that. I'm feeling healthy. I think I, I can stay with you. And I, I can, mean, I feel too. like I'm pretty, you, you know, yeah, I'm you, young enough to go a little while longer. Yeah. I, <laughs> well, I wonder how they like my new look with my new hat. Oh, I'll tell you what. You can't, you know, and you got the Harley uh, sweater on, and you got the hat. You need you need the motorcycle with the sidecar now. You know, well, it's like those English gentlemen. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, not the trike that I right, have. Right, you need a sidecar. Well, I can maybe put a sidecar well, onto that. Why not? <laughs> make it a, a big sedan. I bet if you call those guys in Texas that you want to make something new, I oh, bet they'd be glad. Oh, they'd be glad to do it. Uh, they have great engineering company over at uh, 
the trike company in Tyler, right out of Tyler, Texas, so you Trump, go. Texas. How about Piggly Wiggly? We'll hit a couple of sponsors here. That way we can keep going more than 25 years. Uh, Piggly Wiggly, all your grocery needs, three locations. Simsport, two Annapolis is one on the north end of town, one on the south end of town. But we had a good little pork roast preseason. We cooked at the house this past week. It was excellent from Piggly Wiggly. We've got the pork chops, buck 19 a pound. Bottom round beef steaks, that's Angus beef, two ninety nine a pound. And even got pork loin back ribs, two forty nine a pound. Go buy Piggly Wiggly, the pig knows best. You bet. And one more. One more, How yes. How about uh, we hit Carl's Thrift Away. I believe the 50% off sale is still going on right now for certain uh, decorating items and Christmas type items in the store. You look for that red tag at least for another two to three days. So go by, you can get that, but all your pharmacy type things, all your prescriptions, all your medications over, over the counter, they can compound multiple medicines to make it easier for you to take. So you don't have to take all those little pills. You can put them all together in something nice and easy to handle. Uh, home decorating, uh, gifts, they can even go to your house to give you ideas and do them. They did a beautiful wreath for you one year for Christmas that was, that thing was big as your whole fireplace. Well, you're going to see yeah, it today gonna, on, show, on the fireplace. Show it in a couple of minutes, yep. that's right. Sure will. Carl's thrift away. Now, what do you want to talk about? Well, uh, early this morning before uh, coming here, I uh, went over to Melanson Funeral Home uh, off of uh, one uh, Interstate I-49 uh, on the east side uh, where Melanson has a beautiful facility there to visit with the family of Vera Schmidt. Vera was, uh, prior to marriage, was a Zerang, mm -hmm. and uh, she was a classmate of ours uh, at Opelousas High School, and uh, I remembered one thing in particular about her was that, uh, to my knowledge, uh, she was the first person that we had in our area uh, certainly within our group, but even in our area, that had uh, braces, and uh, it was I a new spoke. Thing. Uh, it was a. It was. It was new so for this new. Area for sure. So new that uh, her son Dale. By the way, uh, I was able to visit with Dale and, and introduced to one of his daughters or his daughter, uh, Angel, and I told him the little story about the braces. Mm -hmm. And he says, I did a little checking on that with Mama after you told me that some few years ago. Uh -huh. And uh, what it was is uh, they had a relative that was a dentist in uh, Houston, and they put uh, Vera on the train right. and she went by train over to Houston to and when she came back she came back with the braces wow. on and uh, that's a we, big project for a little girl big project <laughs> is right and and cutting edge I mean yeah. I, I, to my knowledge she was the first there could have been others but it's what what stayed in my mind and uh, anyhow our very deepest of sympathies on on her death and she was a, a graduate of our class also and then Another person is Mr. Ben uh, Stelly, uh, Antoine Ben B. Avenue Stelly Jr. Mm -hmm. uh, but in and around Leonville and Acadiana, a very well, well known person was uh, Ben Stelly uh, Jr. And uh, perfect picture that they used, uh, mm -hmm. kind of a cap, well, it, that's more of a baseball cap, I yep. guess. Yep. But it's got a little look to the cap I have on. Uh, anyhow, I didn't get to visit with the family, but my very deepest uh, of sympathies uh, and a, a person that I had got to know uh, over the years pretty well. And then one more was uh, Jacqueline Richard uh, Sashry Jr. And they called, they, it was Joe, his father was Joe Sashry uh, Sr. And he was, uh, born here in Opelousas to Mr. Joe Sasher, who went on to Lafayette and had big businesses. I'll come back and talk. We need to take a, we'll take a one, one minute, minute break. break. We'll see you on the other side of one.